Hey everybody, this is Dustin Briley with Briley Brothers. Today we're out in Gilbert, Arizona. We're gonna take a look at this four bedroom, two bath home. It does have a two car garage. It's 1,820 square feet. It was built in 1994. The lot is 6,294 square feet. Best of all, this house does have a pool. It's in need of uh, a good cleaning. There's a ton of algae in it, but it does have a pool. And it can be yours for the price of $624,000. Has been sitting a little while. I think it's been sitting for 24 days. We're starting to see inventory increase here the past uh, 30 days or so and in, uh, inventory is increasing pretty rapidly so there might be some meat on the bones where you'd be able to even get a discount on top of that so if you'd like to see this property i will link to it down in the description and uh, my brother and i are in the top one percent of all realtors we'd love to show you this property or if you just need help buying or selling any property here in arizona we'd love to help if you like this type of content we do one to two of these videos a day each and every day. And so hit that subscribe button if you don't wanna miss out on any of these videos. Right off the entryway, you have this, uh, this would be bedroom number one. Could also be used as an office. It's got nice tall ceilings. It faces the front of the home, it has French doors. And you have your formal living room or dining room or a combination of both here. Once again, vaulted ceilings. Looks like they put their TV there. They were using this as their family room, which opens up into the kitchen. These countertops have some type of coating on them. They're not granite. It they're, they're, uh, looks like they're Formica with some type of epoxy probably coating on them. White painted cabinets. And then gray bottoms. Little spot for a table over here. Looks like there is some new light fixtures. Lots of natural daylight with views of the pool. So that's where we came in. Let's go check out the bedrooms. There has been some patching done that has not been touched up with paint yet, but overall the paint's in pretty good shape except for the patching. laundry room. It's not super bright, but it does have kind of a cool light up there. That two-car garage. And then off the garage we have bedroom number one. Vaulted ceilings. Makes it just appear much, feel much bigger than it really is. And then there's a coat closet off the garage too with some linen storage right there. Here's bathroom number one. Bathtub shower surround. Here's a... Uh, Two more cool lights. So that was bedroom number two, because we have the one in the front. Here's bedroom number three. And then bedroom number four, the primary. I love how it has great views of the pool. Jetted bathtub. Looks like they have new light fixtures kind of throughout. And then the uh, walk-in closet actually goes pretty deep. Let's go check out the best part.
Okay, so the neighbors behind you have a lot of trees and then to the right, there's a lot of trees. So that adds a lot of privacy. They have painted the block wall, which is nice. It's a large pool, it's pretty long. It's almost the whole distance of the yard. You have a little step up there. You could put some loungers up there. This surface right here, you've heard me say before, it's called cool decking. It's basically a coating that goes on top of concrete. Sometimes it does peel off, that can be repaired. It's not necessarily a huge deal. You do have your pool equipment here. It looks like they had an idea of possibly covering the pool equipment. Maybe kind of gave up on that. And then you can see the pool itself is uh, very dirty. I'll show you the other end too. But look how long this is. Oh, I almost fell. That step got me. Okay, so check out the inside of the pool. That's pretty bad. I don't see too many pools this dirty. This time of year, the temperature just got hot the last month or so, and so that's causing a lot of the pools to go haywire. Got the AC unit over there. New exterior paint, it looks like. All right, well, if you have any questions, our contact information is going to be down in the description. If you made it this far, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our future videos since we do one to two of these a day, each and every day. And if you want to see this property, you just want help buying and selling real estate, let us know, reach out to us, and the, uh, the, uh, I will link to the listing down in the description. As always, thanks for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you on the next video.